Hi, my name is Akiva Goldman. I'm the director and founder of Goldman and Associates. Our firm has a primary focus on family law issues here in Michigan. Today, we're going to uh, continue our video series designed to educate and inform the public, so please subscribe to our channel. A lot of times during parenting time environments, we have one parent giving over the child and sending personal items of the child to the ex. They're doing that so that, for example, they send the child for the weekend, they send a bag, they send a suitcase, you know, pajamas, toiletries, stuff to wear. That's the appropriate thing. But a lot of times we hear, I send stuff, I never get it back. So I, I, I keep sending and sending. Meanwhile, I'm depleting the child's wardrobe uh, and I'm sending it to mom and she only sees a child on alternating weekends. I'm sending him to dad and he he's rarely involved, but a, a few days a month. And now he's got my child's wardrobe bill. What do I do about that? So I would say this. There's a couple ways to handle it. If there's a good give and take where things come back that go out, that's perfect. But when you have the situation that I'm describing, one of two things has to happen. Either you tell the father, look, I'm no longer packing a bag. You've got ample stuff. When he or the child grows out of it, I'll send more stuff. But at that point in time, you're going to use the stuff that you have. There's no there's no point in doing that. Or the, the father or, or the visitation parent may say, you know what? You don't have to send stuff. I'm buying a wardrobe for the child. When the child is with me, he or she's going to wear this. And you know what? That may actually be a good thing. It may be a bonding situation where you can go with the child, have the child pick out what they like, and then keep it by you. And maybe that's a great way to do it. Sometimes finances don't permit the parties to have multiple wardrobes for the same child. So therefore, there has to be more of a give and take. I would say this. If you're sending your child for parenting time and not getting the stuff back, you need to video inventory everything. And it's not that hard. Take a video, take a, a screenshot of all the outfits that are being put in and saying, here's an inventory, here's the outfit. Here's a list, mom, of what I've sent. Make sure that these eight things come back. If you have repeated violations and it's not, tell your lawyer and they have, file a motion and get the court to order that you're no, you're not sending anything and he's got to get his own stuff. You do it that way, I'm sure you'll get the appropriate cooperation. If you have any questions about that, reach out and of course we'll be glad to help you out.